Good morning everybody, Scooter here at Granville Guitars, coming to you live from the Granville Guitars World Headquarters. Going to run off a quick little clip here. Uh, this is another of Alex Webster from Cannibal Corpse. Uh, this has been his main base for the sessions that are uh, going on right now. By the time you see this video, uh, you will know about the sessions and the album will be out for now. It's uh, it's a big secret, so keep it to yourself. Uh, this is the bass Alex has been using on all of the tracks so far. Uh, they have been using a G-sharp tuning with the lowest string on the five-string bass, uh, a G-sharp, C-sharp for the next string up, F-sharp, B, and E on top. So that's... Uh, that's quite a bit lower than standard. <laughs> anyway, as you see, uh, this is this was one of Alex's earliest uh, prototypes of the. Uh, well, it wasn't a prototype. It was a very early production model. Uh, the, if you look closely, you can see on some of the inlays here, they were still having a little problem with the red inlays, and they they cracked a bit. Um, I actually had to repair these inlays at one point. Uh, they were starting to all sort of pull up and I had to I had to do some emergency surgery on on the inlays on this guitar uh, a fair number of years ago but um, they got that remedied and the as is all specter basses this is an extremely nice instrument very very well made well used and well loved as you can see Alex uses these daily um, this is his signature model, of course, with the uh, blood spatter on it. Uh, and it has his uh, script style name on the back of the headstock along with the serial number. Not going to show you the serial number. Sorry, guys. Um, it has the uh, Alex Webster uh, Seymour Duncan pickups. And it has the dark glass preamp in it, uh, which has two mid-range bands right here. It does not have a treble control. It has two mid-bands. Very interesting concept. I really like it. Uh, he's running it at 18 volts. And uh, it's in my shop today on the bench uh, from the studio across the hall to receive a new set of strings and to be tuned to the A-sharp tuning for those songs. There are, I believe, two or th maybe three songs on the new record that will be in the higher tuning of A-sharp, which is only four steps below standard <laughs> instead of five. <laughs> So, I'm going to put strings on this bad boy. Alright, here we are once again. We have strung this bass up. I also wanted to mention, too, that this one has uh, one of his ebony speed ramps on it, uh, which helps with accuracy and technique uh, on the right hand. It really works nicely. Uh, he has these made for him, and they're, whoever does them is, is really, really good. Uh, it's made of ebony. It follows the curvature of the fretboard. Really works nicely. Uh, once again, we are in the uh, A-sharp tuning, which is the higher of the two Cannibal Corpse tunings. We have an A-sharp down here. And we go to a D-sharp. G-sharp. C-sharp. And finally, F-sharp on top. <laughs> so it's way down there kids very suitable for uh, extreme metal uh, and and uh, whatever you want to use it for by golly uh, great great instrument uh, Alex is a fantastic player uh, if you don't know of Cannibal Corpse check him out uh, it's not everybody's cup of tea but hey that's all right uh, anyway that's all I know for today I'm just preparing to uh, fine-tune the uh, intonation on this bad boy with my uh, con strobe tuner that I always use for these occasions so once that's done this will be ready to lay down tracks on the A-sharp songs for the new Cannibal record um, that's all I got for today if you got any questions about anything we do here at Granville Guitars feel free to contact us on the web at www.granvilleguitars.com you can also find us on Facebook and you can seek out our new blog, A View from the Granville Bench, over at WordPress. Thanks very much, and have a metal day.